Be sure to check out the Patreon if you want to view the full length uncut and gain early access to all of the videos. We have exclusive shows over there and lots of bonus content available. The link will be in the description down below. This is the crop feeder. Oh yeah, that's right. Really feeding people crabs? Yeah, feeding crabs people. He passed in peace, I hope. Yes, Your Grace. He was found who passed gently in his sleep. Who? Just some random guy. <laughs> we don't care about him. The Crown will compensate you for your ship and crew and make an offering to the men's I don't want compensation. I want justice! My favorite character. I want to seize the stepstones by force and burn out this crab feeder. Yeah, basically. <laughs> the Pacific Kingdoms have never entered open war with the free cities. The losses would be incalculable. Incalculable. I've never heard anyone say that. Incalculable? Damon has squatted there for over half a year without even a protest from the crown. I'll caution you, Lord Corlys. That's his name, Cla Lord Clawless? Clawless. My favorite character. The Stepstones will be settled. In time. You have Dragon Riders, Father. Dragon Riders? Oh, she spoke up. Yeah, I was wondering, like, she wasn't being included in the thing. Send us. Yeah, she pours the drinks for the men. <laughs> <laughs> They're sleeping on her. We should at least... Perhaps uh, there's some better use for the princess's talents, Your Grace. They don't like Why it when she talks up. She is the hair, though, right? Yeah. Like eventually, she is gonna like rule. She's picking the new Lord Commander Knight person. I want you. <laughs> She's the guy with the yellow outfit. He looks cool. That guy. <laughs> What are the people with the white hair? Targaryens and the Clawleys. So everyone with white hair are is a Targaryen? Except for the Clawleys. Sir Rhyman was knighted at eight and ten. How many of these knights have combat experience? Nope. <laughs> You've got a point. Sir Kristen Cole. He's the one that beat Damon. Mm -hmm. I fought for a year as a foot soldier against the Dornish incursions. They fall in love. The worst towers along the Reavers from the Iron Islands. Those men are tawny knights. My father should be defended by a man who's no real combat. Yeah, all they do is play a little game on the horse. <laughs> That's about it. Jousting, I think it's yeah. called. We need somebody ready to slay a dragon. Over a thousand dragons. And maybe large enough to span the seas of the world. That's a thousand dragons? Ain't no way. In that ancient city, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Valeria will never be seen again. Valeria. Foreshadow. I don't know. <laughs> he dragged <laughs> it. Just like he dropped the statue, so maybe that's like signified that. I don't know. <laughs> Tell me, how is Rhaenyra? What do you mean? Well, these days she doesn't say more than a few words to me. I wonder why. I find it difficult to discuss personal matters. I wonder why, buddy. <laughs> she doesn't like you. <laughs> I wish she would approach me. Well. I think she would open herself to you if invited. You do have such an easy way about you, Your Grace. I don't know, you killed her moms and her, her little brother, so I don't know about that. You do not mention our talks to Rhaenyra, do you? You dating her best friend. Wait, exactly. really? That's Rhaenyra's best friend. Wait, they're dating? Well, her dad sent her to his chambers to, like, talk to him. Mm-hmm. Like, in these times... It's just a like, norm? Yeah. Well, like, she's like 15. It's weird that he's talking to her in his chambers yeah. alone. How many candles do you need? This is like the church. The shrine. Yeah. Your father loves you. He chose you for his heir. He didn't choose me. He spurns Damon. So he only did it to like make it so his brother wasn't gonna be in line to... I mean, the king does love his daughter and is choosing her as an heir, but all the people who convinced him to do that, they just didn't want Damon. Mm-hmm. And because the king isn't that old, they expect that he'll marry a new person and have a son eventually. Yeah. And that it won't actually be where I know. If I was the way to be with my mother, could you close to her? We what praying? Say. Yep, we're praying. Or something. Whatever you wish. It's only for you and the gods to know. Do we get to hear? Probably not. <laughs> I wish for the world to be different. <laughs> I want him to see me as more than this little girl. 
she gonna try to prove herself and just start like being like the front end of like everything and try to like prove that she can do stuff? The king's brother so disinherited has claimed the Targaryen seat on Dragonstone without challenge. And? And now a foreign power has established a colony in our most critical shipping lane. Do you have a specific course of action to propose, my lord? Let me be king, imagine. Mm. <laughs> Join our families. Oh. With the Targaryen dragons and the Valarian fleet bound in blood, you can show the realm that the crown's strongest days are ahead. <laughs> left, them <spe> left them speechless. The realm expects you to take a new wife sooner or later, Chris, to strengthen your line and produce more heirs. It's like, I'm sick of doing this. I've been doing it for the last nine years. And after nine years, the one time that he got a son, it didn't work they out. Died. This is awkward. Yeah. <laughs> you don't like me, do you? Imagine. <laughs> Sense. A regret of mine. We should <laughs> I loved your mother. Very much. Oh really? As did I. So quiet. Uh, what is that? Is that maggots? Maggots. I better not be eating them. They eating them? No. He always gets skin infections. <laughs> He's kind of like a sickly king. I think it's supposed to eat the dead flesh. No, that's not worth it. <laughs> I uh, dearly loved my own lady wife. Why is there... All the mothers are just passing away. Childbirth a lot of the time. You are the king. But I do not envy you. The right hand man does not want him to marry no. this one because he wants his daughter, the one who's visiting him. Mm -hmm. This is the Lady Lena. Lady who? Lady Lena that he's supposed to be marrying that they want Wait, him to what? marry. <laughs> what was it like flying the Black Dread? You Valerian's last rider. Well, he got to ride the dragon? The massive one. The dragon keepers believe she made home somewhere on the coast of the Narrow Sea. They say it's a sad thing. I imagine even dragons get lonely. Aww. It would be a great honor to join our houses. I would give you many children of pure Valerian blood. He looks like he's 40. <laughs> <laughs> She's 12 or something. What did your mother tell you? That I wouldn't have to bed you until I turned 14. He clearly doesn't want a new wife. He doesn't want right? to marry a child. <laughs> <laughs> I did not ask for a lesson in politics. I asked whether this bothers you. Lena is your daughter, Princess. Does it bother you? Yeah. Of course it does. Yeah. <laughs> whether it's to my daughter or to someone else's, your father will remarry sooner than late. His new wife will produce new heirs. He doesn't have a lot of time left, right? Guys can't, well. No, guys can yeah, have guys, kids yeah, in yeah, like yeah. 70s. Yeah. She's telling us straight that you won't be queen. <laughs> I'll create a new order. Don't make me laugh. They denied you, Princess Rhaenys. The queen who never was. Here is the hard truth, which no one else has the heart to tell you. You will never be king, queen. Your father is no fool. She's mean. <laughs> she said, watch me. Lord Corlys Valarian has offered the hand of his daughter, the Lady Lena. They couldn't have chose anybody else? Like, why Why her out of everyone? His family is like the other house with dragons, like the mm -hmm. other family. Oh, so dragons. it's like royalty sort of thing? Marriages are like, in this time, they're like business propositions. And she technically, although she's young, she is the best match. Mm -hmm. What is it? Show us! The dragon that he dropped and smashed. Oh. <laughs> I told you it was foreshadow or something. She had it mended. This is a very kind gesture, Alicent. Very kind. Uh, interrupted. Couldn't have a special moment, could we? Come. Oh, he went into like king, king uh, mode. Marcel Gildon, Lord Vicio, and Lord Tupidas. Wait, they got their own language? Yeah. Are, are we like hearing the English and, and their like perspective, there's a whole new language or what? 
Or they actually speak in no, English. They're speaking English, but the how the houses from Valeria, you know that ancient place that they're from. They have their own language. This is the language of ah. Valeria. Like, what's going on? <laughs> is to have a dragon's egg placed in the babe's cradle. His brother's stolen an egg. Is he gonna be a villain or something? He kind of gives me villain energy. Not villain energy, but he's gonna be like causing trouble. Yeah, he's a nuisance at this point to the king. We believe in his hall. What? <laughs> kind of, she's the one who owns the brothel. Ah. Uh, the realm is watching, your grace. What would you have me do? The realm? Send him to the wall. The higher ups, or? That's like the entire country. It's what oh. they use to say the country. It's the egg that they chose for the baby that died. Wow. And stolen. I will go to Dragonstone and drag David Flash. I said, I'm gonna do it myself. Yeah. Is he allowed to? Yeah, he's not allowed to. I thought they let the king like go out and do like yeah, combat style <laughs> stuff in the front lines. But he's gonna do it? Yeah. Right hand man. He can't have the king dying before he marries his daughter. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you destroy yourself? She picks the nails. Oh yeah, we saw her doing it during the um the tourney thingy. The jousting thing. He kinda controls her, like she doesn't actually right. want to be with the king. Uh, it's, her dad right. is obsessed with the power and mm -hmm. wants. And she feels like guilty because Rainier is her best friend and she's going behind her back and dating her dad. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? This is Dragonstone. This is where David's oh, taken this place the looks egg. Cool. Yeah. Wait, what? This is the first place that the Targaryens landed in before they took the whole country. They mm -hmm. came to Dragonstone and they built this castle. It's a, ma it's a massive yeah. castle. I'm just envisioning like a dragon wrapped around the, this the is tower. Where, this, yeah, this is where the heir of the king is supposed to live before they be take over. Is everybody gonna die? What are we about <laughs> to see? <laughs> Was this the Great Wall of China? Oh, he has the egg. Just tossing it around. It's valuable, right? Yeah. You're to relinquish the dragon's egg, disband your army. Nope. Your whore. Nope. It's a Crispin, wasn't it? It's a Crispin call, my prince. Perhaps my prince recalls when I knocked him off his horse. <laughs> <laughs> he just set himself up for that. Are you so desperate for the king's attention that you've resorted to skulking about like a common cup I'm simply keeping with the traditions of my house. Why's well, the egg gotta match his outfit? And what have you read of the city watch? Aiding the prince in his treason? The king made me their commander. They are loyal to me. You've come for the egg. Take it. Here it is. Are you mad? They're gonna fight, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> To choose violence here is to declare war against your king. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I want. Ah, snap. He seems like he's ready. He's kind of like in the middle. While well, these yeah, this guy's like this standing guy's back. <laughs> oh, wait, is that a dragon? Yeah. Y'all bought a, a whole dragon? Really? Well, this is Damon. Yeah, I don't think they're not equipped to fight a dragon, no, right? They're, <laughs> they're he, gonna he, die. He thought he'd just like roll over and. So here you take the egg yeah. back. Do I see how it is? <laughs> see the fucking steel. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> not fighting? Yeah, why would you? It's a whole dragon in the back. They should have brought one just in case. Well, only a Targaryen can ride a dragon to oh. control it. And only Targaryens know that language. Is the king a tar Targaryen? Yeah. That's why. So everyone's hair who's white yeah. is. Okay. They're a Targaryen or they're the Clawleys. Whose dragon is this? We got two? This is Rhaenyra. She's. Ah. Took She's matters into her own yeah. hand. The other one looks kind of like way more scarier, though. Hers kind of seems smaller. Is it? Well, they, they, they're all of like different ages. Yeah, <laughs> we talked about it, right? <laughs> oh, she's not even pregnant. He just made it all. I'm right here, Uncle. The reason that you were disinherited. You'll need to kill me. He's not gonna do it. 
He does, I imagine. <laughs> okay. No. Basically. Oh, he gave her the egg? Yeah. That was easy. He's kind of a, a complex character. Like, he does love his family. He doesn't want to hurt her. So he's not the and stereotypical he's, villain? Yeah, he's basically doing it for attention because he feels like nobody. Yeah. <laughs> he's throwing adult tantrums, yeah. basically. Yeah. All right, I got an idea. I know what I'm going to do next. Is he always just going to be scheming? <laughs> Doing pranks and throwing tantrums? Adult tantrums? I just want attention. You want us so we want to be with? <laughs> <laughs> you lied? On the morrow. What does that mean? On the morrow? Tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> I came to you to be liberated. From what? Fear. She didn't get that, huh? Like, <laughs> <laughs> no. Is that the same one that she fixed? Yeah. He's fallen in love with her. I mean, the choice between a 12 year old and like, I think Allison is only like 15, 16. Well, it's not, it's it's, not. Yeah, it's not that big of a difference, <laughs> but it is a difference. Driftmark makes for a better ally than it does an enemy. Sea Snake has made a calculated reach. Fair play for a man of his position. I'm listening. That's, that's the look that he's, he did. Save Lord Corliss and fix him at your side. Permanently as an ally. Ah, snap. The princess has returned from Dragonstone. Oh yeah, he's gonna know about what she did. <laughs> Basically save those guys. Yeah. Yeah, I said. <laughs> like, shut up. If it wasn't for me, your right hand man would have died. You went to Dragonstone. <laughs> How far away is that? Probably quite far. Your mother's absence is a wound upon. This is the first time he brung this up. It feels like the first like conversation between the two of them. They had that dinner before. But they talked about the mom? Not really, no. The king has taken your life. I could never replace your mother. But I am going to. <laughs> <laughs> but I will. You are the king. And so your first duty is to the realm. To the people. To take a new wife. Up. Oh. It's about time that he starts clapping. <laughs> It's not gonna be the girl, right? It's gonna be a surprise? Who? They all think it's the 12 year old. The Lady Alison Hightower. Who's that? That's her. Oh, her right there? They, yeah, they were all expecting it to be the 12 year old. Now he's gonna be very offended. We're going to war. We actually, maybe like, breaks him up a little bit because that would have created an alliance if he would have went with the 12 year old. Yeah. And I am your king. But now they're kind of broken up. Not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't just break them up. Her and Rhaenyra are never friends again after this. Oh, wait, really? They're best yeah. friends, though. Yeah, she's marrying her. <laughs> <laughs> when I ascended the Driftwood throne, I knew what I wanted. Villain arc started. I've always thought of you and I as having been well, who's he talking to? Is it going to be his brother? It is! <laughs> <laughs> I'm calling everything! We're both men who have had to cut our own way through the world. We've been passed over too often. It's time we join forces and we overtake the king! The crowd feeder is backed by powerful entities within the free cities who wish to see Westeros weakened. And the king's failures have allowed him to accumulate. Oh, are we like crucifying people? It's earned. What is this? This is the crab feeder. Is that the boss or something? Yeah. <laughs> Final boss? Yeah. He's the one feeding everyone to the crabs. They look weird. Is it just one person or is it like a, a village, no, a he, tribe? Yeah, he has like a whole like army of people. Why are, this, why are the credits eight minutes, 10 this minutes? There's a lot of people who go into making <laughs> the show. It is, like a, it is a well made yeah. show, so. Any questions? Anything you didn't understand or you any question that about? I say is more of like just tell me this and it spoil it. So I'm just no questions. I think. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the reaction to episode number two of House of the Dragon. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you guys haven't yet already. And check out the Patreon for the full length reactions. You guys can find that over there. But with that being said, we'll be seeing you on the next one. Peace!